not his real name. So it looks to be in great shape. It may smell like vinegar, but it looks great. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's a newsreel of Noah's Ark. You give the year 1928. You are heading down Hollywood Boulevard toward an event that reached its peak of glamour in the roaring 20s. The Hollywood opening night. Crowds jam the sidewalks to catch a glimpse of their favorite stars. But 30 years have passed. How many do you remember now? Flapper Olive Borden and Viral George O'Brien. Dignified John Bowles. Ruth Rowland, Queen of the Cereals. The beloved Lionel Barrymore. I love that. Boyish William Collier, Jr. Oh, Cecil B. DeMille, producer, director, and showman. Writer Daryl F. Zanuck, Destin Bofane. Lovely and charming Irene Rich. Matinee idol Conrad Nagel. Gus Edwards, who wrote School Days. Comedian, Benny Rubin. That's debatable. Suave, funny, Reginald Denny. Flashing, Ben Lyon. Strong, silent, Monty Blue. Samuel Goldwyn. Joseph Skank with Lily Demita, who later married Errol Flynn. Good-natured, Gwyn, Big Boy Williams. Noah Beery and Sid Grauman of Grauman's Chinese Theater. Scene of this glittering premiere. The beautiful Dolores Costello, wife of John Barrymore and star of Noah's Ark, the film to be at last unveiled inside. For three years, Noah's Ark had been in production. Its cast numbered 10,000. Its cost, highest till then, was $2 million in a day when a new car could be bought for 500. Now from Hollywood Boulevard, we move across the continent to the Great White Way. It's lights aglow in an age of prosperity, prohibition, and flaming youth. We are traveling toward the Winter Garden Theater for the Broadway opening of Noah's Ark, destined to astonish the tough New York critics. The Daily News said, It surpasses everything of its kind ever given to the cinema before. The Sun called it one of the finest examples of spectacle that the movies have ever offered. The Herald Tribune reported, It contains some of the most stirring episodes in the annals of the screen. The world hailed it a masterpiece and said it adds to the record of the motion picture, another major moment of which it may well be proud. Since these comments were made, the years have rolled by. Acting styles have changed. Stories have grown more sophisticated. The Vitaphone banner. I think you'll discover the suspense and grandeur of this film remain undimmed by time. So come inside. We believe that like the audiences of three decades ago, you will find excitement and inspiration in Noah's Ark.